This is the moment a brand new 758 meter long bridge in China is destroyed. You are looking at the Hongqi Bridge in Sichuan Province. It was only completed this year. On Tuesday, November 11th, a massive landslide completely wiped out a section of it in seconds. But the most incredible part of this story isn't the collapse. It's the fact that no one was on it. As of today, November 12th, the investigation is in full swing and the details are fascinating. How did authorities know to close the bridge just in time? And why did a brand new piece of engineering fail so spectacularly? Let's get into it. This wasn't a stroke of luck. This was a life-saving call. To understand how they averted a massive tragedy, you have to see the timeline. Monday, November 10th, afternoon. The first alarm. Routine inspectors on the ground detect slope deformation on the mountain right next to the bridge. Monday, 5.25 p.m., the danger is confirmed. They find visible cracks on nearby slopes and roads. The mountain itself is literally moving. Monday evening, the call is made. Authorities immediately shut down the entire 758-meter bridge. No more traffic. Monday, 11 p.m., the bridge is clear. All stranded vehicles are evacuated and the site is secured. Tuesday, November 11th, approximately 4 p.m. This. Less than 24 hours after the closure. A perfect evacuation, but a total, catastrophic engineering failure. So, the bridge is gone. Zero casualties, thank goodness. But the big question everyone is asking is, why? As of today, the official investigation is focused on three main suspects. Suspect number one, extreme geology. This is the obvious culprit. This bridge was built in a notoriously volatile region. It's steep, it's seismically active, and it's famous for landslides. Investigators are trying to determine if this was just a freak of nature that no amount of engineering could have stopped. But it might be more complicated than that. Which brings us to suspect number two, the Mega Dam. This is fascinating. The Hongqi Bridge is located right next to the new Shuangzhangkou hydropower station. This isn't just any dam. It's set to be the tallest dam in the world. And here's the kicker. It only started filling its massive reservoir with water in May 2025. Investigators are now scrambling to find out if billions of gallons of water soaking into the ground for months destabilized the entire slope. Did the new dam basically push the mountain over? And that leads to the most controversial question. Suspect number three human error. And this gets into a bit of a touchy subject. This bridge was new. It just opened this year. And this has raised serious public concern about construction standards. The contractor, a major state-owned company, has already, according to reports, removed promotional videos of the bridge from its website. That is not a good look. The public is demanding to know was the design flawed? Were corners cut during construction? And did they fail to account for the known geological risks and the brand new mega dam right next door? So where does this leave us? Right now, this is a story of two things. A disaster averted by an incredible warning system and a billion-dollar engineering failure. The final report on this collapse will be scrutinized by engineers all over the world. But I want to know what you think. Was this a freak act of nature? Or was this a preventable human error? Let me know your theory in the comments below. If you want to stay updated on this story and other engineering breakdowns, make sure to like this video and subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching.